a crack now, sit your ass down. I got stuff I never had now. I can brag now. Yeah, my niggas they gon' spread. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jamie Flow back. With another video, we doing a QA. and a uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed this video, y'all always asking me so many questions when I live stream, so I figured, I mean, you know what I'm saying, why not, let's go answer these questions, let's knock these out, so we're gonna answer these questions, but, but like, I, like I said, I mean, I'm gonna answer these questions as best as I can, every time I live stream, y'all asking me, like, a million thousand different questions, and I'm always trying to answer them, like, but it's like the same thing, like, hey, J-Man, what's your favorite team, Eagles, 10 minutes later, what's your favorite team, Eagles, 10 minutes later, what's your favorite thing? You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna get y'all one place so I'm gonna answer all these questions. So there is so many questions, so I know a lot of people usually have their comments pop up on the screen like, ooh, ooh, ooh. I mean, I'm not gonna be able to do that. Y'all Y'all ask like, it's 164 questions. So I'm not, that's, that's way too much editing. But like I said, I hope y'all can hear, like I hope y'all, I'll still say y'all name and stuff, so shout out to y'all. But like, like I said, leave a like on the video. I hope y'all enjoy this channel. All right, let's get straight into this thing, bro. All right. First question come from, come from my boy Sebastian Ya DeMarco. What's the first Madden I ever played? The first Madden I ever played was probably Madden NFL 2005. I think that's it when Ray Lewis was on the cover. My mom and my parents bought that for my brother's GameCube, and that was the first Madden I ever played on Game. All right, this next question comes from Resurrection. Do you enjoy YouTube? How long will you do it for? Yes, I enjoy YouTube. How long will I do it for? Hopefully, I can do it full time. Like. If I become a big YouTuber, but that's why you're in college. Like that's why I'm in college, so you get an education, so you can still have a job. You know what I'm saying? That's why I'm not just gonna drop out and dedicate my whole life to this. But like I said, everyone can't afford to go to college. So if YouTube is something you want to do and you don't have that option of going to college, if you work hard, stay motivated, and do. And this is really if this is the most important thing. If this is really what you love to do, you really enjoy YouTube. Yes, you can. Anyone can do YouTube full time if they really put their mind to it. And if you actually love what you do, that's the main thing. Don't do it for the money. Well, what school are you going to switch to? I'm going to the University of Finley just for, it's a lot of reasons now this semester. I did go to Ohio Northern, but now I'm going to the University of Finley in spring 2017. But like I said, uh, it's just a lot of reasons. I don't feel like getting into all that, but uh, that's come from my boy, It's Stutter. My boy, Logan Mantez said, what, what made you start YouTube? What made me, I always wanted to start YouTube since I was like, I had to say, I always wanted to start YouTube since I was like a sophomore in high school, I want to say, but so I asked for a game capture device for my PlayStation 3 when I was like a sophomore. I got it, but like I didn't know how YouTube worked, I didn't know how to edit videos, I didn't know what software you needed. All I had was a capture card and I like uploaded one video, but it was like, it was hard. I just didn't know what I was doing, didn't have the right people to help me, or I didn't look up like i just when you don't know what you're doing and you're doing it by yourself it's a lot harder you can start it uh but when you if but well, once i got older i knew like i actually knew how to look things up i actually knew how to figure out how to do stuff i wasn't a sophomore in high school anymore so i figured out everything i needed uh everything you needed to know about youtube i figured that out i did my research all the time i always tried to find a way to get better and edit videos and boom here we are 25k strong okay this next question come from my boy Austin Smith, can I expose you? Kidding, but for real, can I make you a logo and branding? You're my favorite Madden YouTuber. I mean, if you want Austin, that's up, that's up to y'all. Like, like a lot of people send me overlays that I use, and I try to use as many overlays as y'all send me as possible, like in my stream, just cause like, like y'all support me, so I want to support y'all and shout out to y'all. So like, yeah, Austin, if you want to do that, go ahead, bro. Okay, this this comes from my boy Big Dog. Would you come to Cali for a fan meetup when I get a bigger channel? If I get a bigger channel, yeah, I can go a different places for fan meetups, but you know what I'm saying, I need to, like, if I get a bigger channel, probably like 300k subs, then at that point, I can probably be doing YouTube full time, because I, and I'm, and since I'm not partnered with, like, another network, they're not taking, like, 70, 30% of my profits, like, everything going to me, so, like, I will have enough money to be able to do that if I get a big channel, but that's all up to God, you know, God gonna lead my way, God gonna direct you to whatever path he wants to direct you, so, it's not really up to me. Okay, my, this next question comes from my boy, Gregory. What led you to your college and towards the degree you want? Uh, what led me to my college? I mean, I don't know. I don't really know what led me to my college, but the degree I want, like, ever since I was little, I just always liked the shows like Law & Order, White Collar, any type of show like that, Criminal Minds, any type of criminal justice shows. I just love those shows. So I'm like, hey, 
we might as well go pre-law criminal justice. You know what I'm saying? So, because that's what I love to do. I'm interested in those shows. Like, don't do anything for the money. Like, if you hate, like, if you hate math, science, if you hate all stuff like that, you like, oh, I'm gonna be a doctor because they make two hundred thousand dollars a year. If you don't love what you do, you're gonna hate. If you're gonna hate what you do every day, it's not. You're not gonna have a happy life. You know what I'm saying? The next question comes from my boy Max Lambert. Are you gonna play 2K17? I am gonna start playing more games on this channel, but I gotta work my way into it. I just can't start uploading these games immediately. Cause first of all, I gotta figure out like how to edit those type of gameplays. Cause every different type of video game has a different type of certain way you're supposed to edit. Like I can't edit a 2K video the way I. Ex uh, like the way I edit Madden videos. It's just like different sound effects, different things. So I am trying, I am leaning more towards that, but school is about to start for me in like three days. So I'm still gonna try, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best here. I got y'all, I always say I got y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try my best. Who inspired me to start playing Madden? I mean, for real? For real, myself. I, I just always liked Madden. Like Madden 25 is when I really wanted to play Madden. So that's when I really started playing Madden. But then I Maverick. I don't know if you're, most, most of y'all probably know his channel. He got like 600,000 subs. But I, like, once I started playing uh, Madden, I wasn't really good at it. So I was like typing in like how to get better at Madden. You know, Madden defense, Madden offensive tips, you know? And then like, our Maverick channel popped up. And it was actually like, it was one of, it was a, it was one of his videos he put out when he, he only had like 17,000 subs. And it was a video called like, uh, what was it called? What was it called, bro? I know it was called something, bro. How to beat Fag D. And a lot of y'all don't know what Fag D is, but like in Madden 13, you were able to drop back like 11 guys in coverage and no your your defensive line wouldn't get pancaked or nothing and people would do this all the time and he uploaded a video on how to playmaker to beat that coverage and that's when i found him and then that's what really made me want to start playing more beyonce or rihanna this oh that's my boy next question from my boy john juan Rodriguez. who are your favorite players in the nfl Right now, my favorite player in the NFL, probably Adrian Peterson. My favorite player of all time is Michael Vick. And by the way, y'all, my favorite NFL team is the Philadelphia Eagles. You know what I'm saying? But anybody who want to know that. My next question from my boy, Ethan Maxwell. When did you start your channel? I started my channel the beginning of September. My, my channel was created in like June or July. I really started my channel in like the beginning of September or the end of August. Like right around that. How did you get so good at Madden? Here's another thing. I wouldn't say I'm like, I would say I'm good at Madden, but I wouldn't say I'm like the top tier elite because like it's like levels to this. Like I know y'all hear this a lot, but like it's really levels to this. Like it's people who play for fun. You know, they just come home from school. So, this, this category is like your dads. People, your dad just come home from work, want to chill and play Madden. Or kids who just come home, you know, play offline franchise mode, play now, stuff like that. Then there's people who like play like who actually play, like know they're doing someone. There's people who play like ultimate team, just, just pitting together the team, they play some connected franchise, but they don't really care about being good at the game. Then there's people who's like good, and they like know what they doing, they like know how the blitzes work, you know, they actually play like competitively semi what. Then there's people who like top tier, who actually play 400 games in a month. You know, they actually compete in these Madden challenges, you know? So I would say I'm just like, I would say I'm like, there's like good people, I would say I'm better like, I'm better than good, like, I would say, like, I'm, like, right above good, like, right below elite, like, that's what I say my level is, but how did I, uh, he said, how did I get so good? Just practicing, though, like, just not even practicing, just, like, just being smart, knowing what you're doing, uh, basically taking away what your opponent wants to do, basically. His next question comes from my boy Nolan, what's the first man I ever played competitively? It was probably Madden 16, at the, in the spring of 2017, salary cap mode. Who wins the Super Bowl this year? Probably the Patriots. Come on, boy, Nicholas Gaines. He said, how tall are you? And what's my biggest fear? I'm 5'11". My biggest fear is probably... Biggest fear got to be clowns, I think, honestly. I mean, clowns. I don't like clowns. Next boy, come on, boy, Easton. He said, j Mel, how old are you? I'm, I'm 20 years old. My birthday is August 20th, if anybody wants to know. But yeah, I'm 20 years old. My birthday is August 20th. Uh, next question comes from my boy, the guy Ditto. Are you addicted to playing Madden? I would say like I enjoy playing it, and like if I had to choose a game, but I don't think I'm addicted. I used to be addicted. Mm, mm. I used to be addicted in spring of 2017, but I don't think I'm addicted anymore. I don't think so. Next question comes from my boy, the holy crapper. How did you grow your channel so fast? Really? I just stay consistent. I just stay consistent, basically. Like kept uploading videos, and finally a video like. Basically went viral. We got like almost 400,000 views, and that's how like it brought a lot more people to my channel. And then, and those people enjoy what I did, 
so then that just helped my channel grow and the other thing is like i'm just i'm just always gonna be myself like a lot of people are like yo you should like a lot like a lot of people like even in some of my older videos they're like yo you should calm down more in your video you shouldn't act so like go super saiyan or, like you act too like you know what i'm saying you too antsy like you should calm down like i'm not like i appreciate them giving me that feedback but it's like if i'm going if I'm gonna make this content, like, I'm gonna always be myself, you know what I'm saying? When I sit here and play a game, I'm gonna give y'all, like, 100% me. I'm not gonna give y'all, like, oh, let me try to be the calm J-Mail, because some people want the calm J-Mail, you know what I'm saying? But there is no calm, like, there's no different type of me. I'm just gonna be me, and, like, hopefully, like, that's the thing. Like, if I'm just being me, like, people who like me, like, they're gonna be here for me, you know what I'm saying? So if I act like someone else in, a, in one video, they're gonna see that video, like, oh, this dude's a nice, chill dude. He's not yelling all the time. And that's just fake, because once I upload a video, once I upload a video of me like being me, they gonna be like, oh, this guy is somebody completely different. They're not gonna want to watch me. So I want everyone who's here right now, I want them to be here just because they like me and not because they like another another version of me. Like I'm always gonna be me, and that's how I think I grew my channel so fast. Just being real, like you don't have to act like these other YouTubers. Like, you don't have to act like Tote. Like you don't have to use Tote sound effect. Like if you don't YouTube, you don't have to use like these other YouTubers sound effects. Like be you. Just that's, that's all I'm saying. Uh -huh. Savian the Great said, what kind of haircut you got? A lot of people ask me about my haircut. I do have a mohawk. I have like a wide mohawk. Like it's messed up right now because my hat. Like a lot of people are like, oh, his hairline messed up. No, I don't think. Hairline's fine. I do got a mohawk. I just like wearing this hat because like it's my lucky hat. Like it's the first hat I use to make it. Like this is the hat I used when I first made my YouTube video, my first YouTube video. And it's just, bro, it's like ever since, every time I wear this hat, it's like some good luck, bro. So I'm gonna keep the good luck going. Like, we gained 25,000 subs in a month, y'all. Like, or 22,000. So it's like, you gotta keep the luck going. Just keep doing what's right, you know what I'm saying? So let's see what else you got. At what point, what, this next question come from Bertha. At what point were you, will, you, will you consider doing YouTube full time? At, at a point where I'm able to make enough money to support me, and I know I can, I'm still growing to support my, like, to be able to support a family one day. Then at that point, I do it full time. So, like, once I'm done with school, like, if I'm at, like, 200,000 subs and I'm making what? Like, let's say I'm making, I don't know, $8,000 a month or, like, $10,000 a month from YouTube. I think, like, I mean, that time, that's 120 grand. Like, that's more than enough. Like, you're in six figures at that point. You know what I'm saying? So, at that point, I can do it full time. Like, and, and here's the thing. I don't want to start doing it full time. Cause once you start doing YouTube full time, like that's really your job. Like you have to, if you're gonna work nine to five at a normal job, you really have to put in those same hours for YouTube, or your channel will start to fall off. So you know what I'm saying? So this next question comes from my boy Old Guy. What is the best blitz in your in my game experience? The best blitz in the game in my experience? I would say that three four odd is probably the best, most consistent blitz in the game. Cause it's it's, just, it's a hard blitz to stop. It's glitchy, and you can the adjustments you can make. You're only sending three people, and the adjustments is ridiculous, you know? Come from my boy Chris Burnett. Jamel, where are you from? What's your favorite team? I am from Cleveland, Ohio, and my favorite team is the Philadelphia Eagles. Next question. Come from my boy Blake Dabble. Will you ever get a PS4? I think at some point, yeah, but like right now, obviously, I'm on Xbox, so I can't help that. But I'm going to try, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going to try uh, to get a PS4 to play with some of y'all, but... You know what I'm saying? That's gonna take time in the future. Like we, it's, it's coming. I just gotta wait on it. Be patient. All right, y'all. I think that's gonna do it. That's all the questions we got. I tried to answer as many as possible. I think I got through. I think I got through all of them. Like I said, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. I'm, I look forward to uploading more mad content for y'all. And if y'all want any tips and tricks, go check out my other videos. Y'all wanna see the way I play? Go check out my gameplays. All those are on my channel, Blitzes, Money Plays, my offensive scheme I uploaded on my channel. A lot of people ask me that. So all the Blitzes and stuff I use, just go look at my channel. But until then, it's your boy, J-Man Flow, a.k.a. Mr. Let's Get It. Let's go.